We're not dead yet. Uh, this is Malix Plays after a long hiatus, which I will be explaining in just a minute. But we are playing Besiege. I've seen this being shot around YouTube, and I decided to give it a shot. Uh, played a little bit of it. It's quite fun. And we're going to start at the beginning level. So, yes, as I was saying, we've been kind of on a long hiatus. It's mostly been to the due to the fact that I've been trying to save up and get the... Uh, <laughs> trying to get some new parts for my computer. And... Do, 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 do. Yeah, so mostly there. I hadn't intended on making any other videos until I had gotten the rest of the parts. But um, I am waiting maybe like another two weeks before I have uh, a video card and everything else um, to begin assembling my computer and so it'll run and have we'll have new we'll have better games uh more more advanced games that we'll be able to play and record and show rather than just a lot of the older versions and we'll have some more fun with it uh, as you can tell i've already got a better mic and yeah that's pretty much that on that front uh this game is basically building siege weapons and oops. as you can tell i've been playing a little bit of it i have a usually good base design start so, motor wheels, but we're gonna pop these up. little steering units. Should probably make this smaller at some point, because smaller ones seem to do better in later levels. But in this case, we're just building a basic, yeah. So, button. So this is, oh, I forgot the front wheels. <laughs> okay, so, start that again. Wheel. Wheel. And now just run forward and wheel. I'm turn around for that guy. Or just lose my entire wheel system. Yeah, so still it's still an alpha and so there's not a lot they're still working on a lot of things. It just came, recently came out. Um, it is fantastic in some regards. And I'm going to try doing this one. Uh, it's one of my favorite things to do. It takes a little bit of a setup. But. Ooh, all joints, foot hinge. I think I built it too tall again. I did. Yeah. So yeah, the only thing I have with this issue is this game is like, it's fun, but it's difficult to build a setup as I have it here, where I'm just, I'm trying to build a catapult. <laughs> and, oops, start from Maybe it's not that difficult, because I can just... I'm trying to get as much height as I can, because... I don't completely understand engineering, but I do know that when it comes to building stuff like this, it's easier... to launch things farther when you have a certain degree of height. I think. I could be wrong. <laughs> Alright. Um, so yeah, there's cogs and cogs. I haven't figured out how to use the cogs. Motor wheels. Nope. Yes. 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 Down. And let's see if I can do this again. See if I can put this additional Height, I'll be able to build this again. Alright. Okay. Oh. I don't. I swear I clicked on it. Apparently not. Alright. Let's see if I can get just. Oh, 
All right, now with this design, there is there does tend to be problems with it. Oh, it's gonna be too big still. Is it? Yes. God damn it. Okay. So yeah, unfortunately, the one thing this game really needs is the ability to. So I can click and drag and rotate the machine. But what it needs is something where I can like make the hinge, like, so I can move the hinge down here more. Cause, well, I'll show you in a second. Cause I'm gonna have to build this real quick. One more step down, which isn't a bad thing. Cause I'll show you what happens when I've uh, every time I've built a good slingshot. Well, not slingshot. Every time I've built this thing. A decent catapult. There's just a slight issue with where it starts. I haven't quite figured out how not to do that. Yeah, that's good. So, whoop. Plow. Let's get that. My thing's too short. Okay. Do, 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 do. Kind of planning ahead. Hold it. And we'll put a bow. There. So, basic built slingshot, but a couple things first. Uh, I need to use braces, because this machine tends to... I wanna, you want to brace your parts so that it doesn't just rip itself to pieces. And then I need springs, which are mechanical. And... Check the number, L. So this is what usually happens when I build the catapult. Oh! This thing is actually pretty stable. I think I... Oh, okay, I see what I did wrong. Okay, so... I braced... <laughs> I braced the um, wrong part. Though, that might actually say... I'm going to try something. But first, I'm going to show you exactly what happens. Alright, so hit play. Boom. I blow myself up. So, normally I have to put some kind of bracer, but that doesn't help me. Because um, I want this to tilt down here more, so it can get more momentum and arc. But, let's start with... Okay, let's see... Brace that way. So, we're going to brace... The problem is, is that I need it to go back, but I need to do it gently, and I haven't figured out quite the way to do that. Maybe adding one more spring. I didn't, my plan was that I was going to try and brace the back here, but it'll have the same problem. It won't be able to move. So let's see what happens if I put a third spring... Here. Hey, it didn't blow itself up, but now... Oh, it works! Alright! That's awesome! I'm really, really pleased with that. And it didn't rip itself apart, too. That's even better. So, there's a way to save this. I'm trying to figure out... Free build mode, nope. Control list, nope, nope, nope. Nope. Already on the ground. Oh, save machine. Okay. We'll name it Smashy. So I'm just saving, like, this is a nice little feature that I like, is that I can save this. So. Because, yeah, I'm going to definitely have to get. I'm going to have to destroy my machine. Because it's just not going to be capable. Here, let me show you. I'm sure this, if you ha if you've seen these videos before, I'm sure you know exactly what's about to happen. We're gonna bring Smashy in, and I'll show you. First and foremost, we're going to just hit play, and then launch. Okay, that really didn't do anything. But now we have to navigate this course. 
and I just, yeah, it's littered with landmines and the sheep chases. So I need a smaller, more agile machine. So destroy, and I need to build the frame. Which we're gonna do something small, so let's do like a tiny version. I just want maneuverability. This is like, it doesn't have a tutorial section like in the traditional sense, but this is very much a tutorial section. I just kind of want them to add more. I think I made it really too small. All right, so one of the tricks I've learned for certain parts is bracing. If you brace parts together like this, maybe I can brace, I don't know if I can brace. I think that was a bad idea. But bracing those together will help hold the machine together when it takes a damage. I can actually turn, cool, so. Ah, nope, there goes the wheel. It doesn't quite work for, <clears throat> other things like it does nothing for the frames but almost wondering all right, first off let's get rid of that brace that might be part of the problem I'm thinking of what else what paneling I just think that makes it look cooler. I don't know if it actually does anything. Hmm, can I rotate this? No. Nope. See, the other thing is that uh, rotations, I don't know if it's just a natural thing and blah, 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 blah about the camera. I already know how to do it. All right, let's see if... Yeah. See, that happens. Like, this is... One of the more, this is basically trying to teach you how to maneuver, but. And I'm toast. Maybe. Oh, no, nope, all my wheels. So, yeah. It's one thing I could try doing. Um, yeah, since recent patches came out that's kind of made a. Uh, added flying, which. I really haven't figured out how to do. I mean, I've attempted it. And you think it'd be easy, but allow me to demonstrate. So, zero to fly. Like, but yeah, you can tell I'm, like, way too heavy. Oh, stop. I'm gonna end up... Oh, I put myself over. <laughs> and I just tore myself apart. Uh, okay. So, I think we're going to call the episode here. While I try and figure out either how to fly or get through this area. In the meantime, this is Malik's Plays, and I'll see you all in the gaming universe.